Shit, Joe, I got to ask you a stupid question. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I've always wondered, uh, has there ever been a point where you're like about to fight, about to do a tournament or something, and you get hit with, I got to fucking shit right now. <laughs> I got to take a shit. That is like the stupid <laughs> night. No, that, no, that's a, every fucking match. Like every fight. Like I'd be shitting my brains out back there just because I don't want to shit. Like. I don't want to get knocked out or something and shit my pants on TV. <laughs> that was always like in the back of my head, you know, like I'm, I don't know. I don't know why I just got like, I, I think I heard like somebody got knocked out and shit. I, I used to wear white fight shorts uh. before. <laughs> and then I heard that and I was like, hell no, I'm switching. All my fight trucks are black <laughs> or dark blue. Like, and I would just be in the back like, warming up and go take a shit. Warming up, make sure I get it all out. Like, so yeah, my stomach was always messed up too. I always have those, you know, bubble guts because yep. of the weight cuts, you know, your stomach, my stomach, and then the nerves and everything. So yeah, I'd always be making sure that you'd be walking out. You're like, fuck, I got like 10 minutes. Maybe take another shit just in case. Because I don't want to be like almost walking out. Like, you know what I mean? So I always made sure my my tank was empty before <laughs> I walked well, out. Thank, thank you for pissing answering. Pissing too, pissing too, you know. But yeah, so it wasn't a stupid question though for me and I. I would, that was always in the back of my mind. I always think like, what would I ask? Like you hear the same questions a lot on these interviews. Like what would I ask? Because yeah, nerves and everything. And I know I experienced that job interview, anything, but it's like those- one time, one time too, bro. I was in Iowa and I was during a wrestling match and I must have had a crazy weight cut. And then you're rehydrating right before the tournament. you know. So like during this match, I had to take the big, like, Oh my God. I felt like, like, this is going to come out, bro. And this guy, I was whipping this guy's ass. And I was trying to relax. Like, I was just trying to chill so I had to wrestle no more. You know what I mean? Like, and he kept coming at me. And I'm like, dude, just relax already. Like, <laughs> like stop. And I just kept taking him down, taking him down. And finally, you know, after the match. when, But, yeah, kind of that in the sport of wrestling, too, because of diets and everything, weight cutting, you're, you're kind of worried about that, too. You're just shitting your pants out there. Yes, and some of those videos have gone viral. Those dudes, like on the MMA fight, amateur, and then that's what they're known for forever. <laughs> I didn't want to be that guy, so I switched to swim trunks and I, I tried to get it all out, bro. I think I'm going to come up with a company, create like some uh, MMA diapers, <laughs> just in case, you know? Because no pretty one's good. Like yeah. Just, <laughs> everyone wearing a big ass diaper out there, big old diaper ass. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs>